Without a calculator, by far the easiest way to solve this is to do it graphically after we have rewritten it as e to the 2x equals 3 minus x, both of which are relatively easy to draw. So let's have a look at our chart here. Here is x, here is y. So looking at 3 minus x first, here is the point 0, 3, and here is the point 3, 0. So this is y equals 3 minus x, nice and easy so far. Now e to the 2x will go through the point 0, 1, and then it will shoot up very, very quickly like that. So the first thing we can notice is there's only one solution in any interval. Now all we need to do is decide, is it in the interval 1 to 100? So let's have a look at the point here, 1, 0, and draw the vertical line up like that. Well, that will go through the line at the point 1, 2, and it goes through the e to the 2x here at the point 1, e squared, which is approximately 7 or something, so it is clear that the crossover point is in the interval 0, 1, and therefore there are no solutions in the interval 100, so the answer is A, 0.